Thank you for choosing our Patio Heat channel. I'm Steve. We provide tips and information to extend the enjoyment of your patio project. Our videos give you a knowledgeable overview prior to investing in your outdoor heating equipment. Whether you are a professional or owner builder, we provide specific details for optimum heat coverage for your application. Post a comment or question, or for developed visual designs, send your request in to designs at patioheat.com. We're here to work with you. For over 30 years, patio heating is the bedrock of our business, expressing what works best. Now let's get heating. All right, so let's go ahead and look at this uh, residential application. So first of all, you can see that there are two chairs that we have here. The other thing I want to say is that, you know, I received a picture from about here, from about here somewhere, and then something of this um, space here. However, I got no um, dimensions, so I'm just kind of assuming some of this information. I assume that the, you know, uh, windows up here are about eight feet off the floor. So if we looked at the dimensions that I have, that I assumed is I have something about um, 15 foot by 11, it might be 12 feet by eight feet off the finished floor to the um, uh, bottom edge of the post here. And then I put these at six inches tall and four inches wide. You can see this is a louvered covered um, pergola area. And let's go ahead and turn that off and just um, gonna show you what I think would be the best for this particular application. And that would be um, utilizing two of the slimline 4,000 watt units. I have them placed centered within um, this span from left to right here. And then also from left to right here and I have them at a approximate 30 degree angle. They're mounted on the uh, bottom edge of this um, beam coming across here, I'll call it, and I have it 30 degrees pointed in towards the center. Let's go ahead and look at the footprint of heat, and you can see the footprint of heat would be ideal for an application like this. If you were to put it on just one side, you're not going to get the full coverage from left to right here. So, you know, if I was to move this, you know, we'll just do this real quickly here. Uh, let's go ahead and try it this way and you can see if I move this over here and then placed it you know I'm gonna just do a kind of a quick placement here you can see that the coverage you know isn't gonna hit a hundred percent right around here you know nor if you were sitting on this sofa would you feel the um, most ideal amount of heat here so that's why I like it where I had it here so let's go ahead and turn that back here and you can see that the coverage is very good for this particular application of the dimension I have if it's 12 inch excuse me 12 feet or 11 feet that I have um, it'll work fine if it's larger further out let's say maybe 15 feet then this may not be the best application um, but I think this is going to be close to what they truly have. So um, I think that's about it. If you're looking for some assistance with your outdoor heating application and you'd like us to review your plans, send your information into designs at patioheat.com. I'm Steve, and please tap that like button if you find this video useful. We don't advertise or not monetize. YouTube does not support us unless we have a thumbs up from our viewers, and we truly appreciate you doing that. Thank you very much. Have an excellent day.